Tell us a story about you driving too much to drink. I hit me in the I me in the I'm not a drinker like that. Let's do this. It's time to start making excuses. Let's suck it up and don't make it happen. The only thing that you never have is what you grab. The only thing that you never have is what you grab. Yo, 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 Team Jackson, it's your boy, Ty. It's your girl, Shara. And we are back with another video. Look, if you're new to the channel, right, we want to say, what up? <laughs> Please subscribe, hit the notification bell. You'll be notified every single time we drop a video. And uh, if you're already part of the family, yo, what up? Welcome back, you dig? Yes. Uh, we're doing a, a collab today. We're very excited about it. And Shara's going to tell she's going to really tell y'all what it is. And uh, she probably get into more detail, I guess, when we eat and explain to y'all what it is. But then we'll pray and get on into it. Okay, you guys, we are doing a collaboration today. It is called the One Big Fa Happy, One Big Happy Family Summer Kickoff Cookout. Yes. So um, we pretty much we're um, having a cookout showing pretty much one of my favorite dishes to make. So one of my favorite dishes to make is this coleslaw. But we'll talk a little bit more about it later. I have to and, and, the, and the potatoes is yours. The and the potato potatoes. Yeah, col yeah, the coleslaw. Potato salad. The, the potato salad. They're both plant-based. And then we have our dog. The feature is the slaw dog. The you know slaw what I'm saying? Slaw dog. We got, we got the slaw, which she's going to tell you about the slaw, what makes it special. And then um, ketchup, beans. mustard, and we got baked beans. Ooh. And we have... Um, so I got some chili on mine. She didn't have any chili on hers. So we'll pray and get on into that. Goodness. Okay. Father, we thank you for this food we're about to receive, for the nourishment of our body. In Yeshua's name, we bless your name and we praise you. Amen. Amen. All right. Let's get into this. Then you go. You got right? Yeah. Something, it's like, it's something's in my Let me eye. see if I see it. It's like, it's like up here. Um, it's it bothering been in me. Yeah. But, um, so you guys, so we dropped the ball a little bit because we should have some red solo cups and we should also have and some paper, paper plates, plates y'all yeah, i didn't i forgot i didn't get it's it, a yeah. cookout mm. okay okay y'all so we are eating the slaw now this is a plant-based slaw it has plant-based mayo chives um what's it called poppy seeds is in it um garlic is in it cashews is in it lemon juice um a little vinegar is in it and, of course, you have your coleslaw, which is the cabbage and the carrots and stuff. But this, y'all, is it's different from the coleslaw you're accustomed to, but it's so good. It's like, if you try it on, like, a burrito, a taco, anything that's good with slaw, it could be a pulled pork sandwich, whatever you eat. Anything. It could be a pulled mushroom sandwich, whatever, chicken sandwich, whatever. You add this on there, it's, like, amazing. So... This so this is the slaw here. I don't know if y'all saw it up close, but you know, yeah. here's a you know, you see a little bit of it right there. Mm -hmm. Another thing that I make is the potato salad. Now, this potato salad, y'all, doesn't have eggs. Oh my god. Everybody's probably <laughs> flipping out out there. Oh my god, no eggs. No eggs? It doesn't have any eggs in it, but you really cannot tell the you really cannot it's tell the difference. Better. It don't it don't give me that weird taste. It's really, really, really good. And so, you know, it's the typical, you know, I put a little onion, I put very little onion in it, because sometimes, you know, if I put too much in there, it's a little overpowering. So I put very, 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 very little onion in it. Of course you got your sweet pickle relish, the um celery. Um I mm, put mm. this time I put a little chive in it. I put chives in it. And I put, um, what else I put in there this time? I you put poppy seeds. You ain't gonna take a bite, go back? Yeah, I am. I just wanna finish some poppy seeds and th those different things. I, yeah, I, I did that on there, so, you know. Yeah, I thought you could have did that and talk, talk and chew gum, remember? <laughs> <laughs> but y'all, it's amazing. Oh, did you tell them what the um, dog actually is? It's a Beyond Sausage. It's a Beyond Sausage, y'all. Trust me. Ooh, look at that, boy. That's slaw. I got me some slaw on the side. Well, we both do. I need actually more on my dog. Mm. Potato salad. Hope it ain't washing out. Mmm. Girl. You monster, you hear me? 
So yeah, yeah, this will this will be what we what we bring to the to the cookout, you dig? Mm-hmm. And I'm sure we probably the only one got anything like this, but it's, I'm telling you it's very clean, very healthy, very light. It tastes real good, y'all. Mm. But they got my baked beans. It's it's plant based too. Mm-hmm. It wasn't really showcasing that, but it is. Yeah. But Mmm. I'm going to be doing some That's talking. Like, you got something you want to talk about? Mm-mm. Baked beans on point, too. Mm-hmm. Just enjoying the cookout. I had to actually go to the store and get this stuff, y'all. I was in the store like, <laughs> I pure your car, sure, I was like, where's, where's the such and such and the such and such at? Well, I know a lot of times with cookouts, it's a good, good, good time. You go out, normally it's family a lot of times. Mm -hmm. Family, friends, y'all come together. People cook on the grill. Um, you know, people just have a good time. But then there's other moments, you know, at the end of the cookout, some people like end up fighting. You got drunk. <laughs> so the start, you know what's wrong when you walk in there. You see about three people with 40s. Oh my God. Playing dominoes in the back or in the kitchen. I'm, look, there's several types of drunks in the world, but I'm going to focus on two of them. You have the laid back, cool. I ain't saying that. Person that a drink, have a good time. I'm not going to say drunks, just drinking because that's, that's something totally different. You have some people that a drink, have a good time, and it's all good. You have other people that get rowdy. <laughs> they want to fight everybody. <laughs> I've been drank. huh? drinking that dark liquor. And everything. <laughs> Y'all know how to get Pookie that dark, that dark liquor. Remember they say don't mix the white with the brown. Is that a real rule? Yeah. Don't mix the I mean, white with the brown. I mean, depends on who you are, I guess. <laughs> Just have a good time, y'all. Don't be fighting. And, <laughs> and the next cookout you have, make sure you drink plenty of water while you're drinking. <laughs> Dehydration is a beast. It's a beast. And that's what makes you feel horrible. You drink, drink, you drink, and be merry. That's what you're supposed to do. But not have drink. Have a good time. Have a good time. If that's what you do, don't be drunk there fighting everybody. Uh, but my dad just say, <laughs> man, that... That joker was pissy drunk. <laughs> Look, I got a story. I remember. Uh oh. When I first got in the military, they put us in dorms. You know, everybody that's single, you go to a dorm because what they want you to do is get acclimated with life before you get out into your apartment. They want you to learn how to learn skills like cleanliness, mm -hmm. neatness. Um, and then they, they just want you to get accustomed to managing your finances better. Because when you're in the dorms, you don't have rent or anything like that. But you might have a phone bill. You might have a cable bill. That, you, you're just taking everything one step at a time. But anyway, I was in a dorm. I was living a dorm life. So, this is how you know whether or not you should go to a gathering. I was invited. One of my coworkers was like, invited me out. Now, let me tell you how he invited me out. To hang. Now, at the time, <laughs> Fred, I can't remember if he called me Shara or my other last name or what. I don't remember. But I remember this story. Go ahead. He was like, Shara, you want to hang? <laughs> he was talking to me like that. So I was like, uh, uh, I think I'll pass. Because <laughs> you know what? And let me tell you why I passed. Because the night was so young. Now, if it was near the end of the night, I could be like, oh, okay. But the night was so young. He was already like. Oh, nowhere else to go. He, yeah, there's nowhere else to go but like, oh my God. But damn. Yeah. And the thing is, I knew him too. So I was just like, no. You, you pick and choose. You know, you, you be very careful with stuff like that. I'm like, no, you know, if it was like a calmer situation, I probably would have hung, but it was just too rowdy at the beginning. Okay, so I think 
think it was the Holy Spirit that night told me just not to do it that night. That night. So, when... That night. <laughs> not the other night. That night. That night. Hmm? Lord said, no, shower, no. That night, he said, nope. Um, <laughs> so, next day, y'all, um, there was an accident with the golf cart. The golf cart ran slam into a tree. <laughs> now, if you want to guess <laughs> what possibly happened, you can probably guess. So, the thing is, anything that's damaged on a military installation or whatever is damaged to government property, especially if it's not yours. So, they're going around asking, y'all know what happened last night? Do y'all know what happened last night? Nobody knew. But I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Come to find out, old boy done got, he was already tore up drunk when I saw him. He got in that golf cart and ran slamming into a tree, and he broke his hips. Both of them? Both hips. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's bad. And I was, I wouldn't think, I'm like, the golf cart go, but I guess it's it, like, in, impact is impact, you know. Mm -hmm. He broke both hips. And so you already kind of knew, like, wait a minute, even if you didn't drive, you were in the golf cart. Even if it was somebody else, you had something to do with it. But he was getting his friends to lie, and I knew he did it. I knew he did it. So he came to me. And this is what I told him. I well, said, they, they should, they, they had to know he did if his hip was broke. <laughs> Only one. Nobody else was scratched up. Nobody else was limping. He in the hospital. No. <laughs> the only one that was on crutches or everything. So, I can't so remember. So why did they even have to ask? They're going to do an investigation. That's just what they do. Mm. They document everything. And yeah. When you get, I came in and been like, when you get in trouble, it's What not happened? Simple. Sergeant Stevenson last night. He broke up, and the and the golf course broke. Golf the golf uh, cart broke up. You know what I was happy about? Well, I'm glad I didn't know anything. In yeah. situations like that, I'm glad I don't know. I was happy when they were like, "Do you know?" Nope. If I knew, I if I, I, yeah, if I, I knew something, I don't know. I didn't go into. I want no rat. I want about to say rat him out and all like that. Well, I did. <laughs> well, I said I don't know, and it was true. Now I could have guessed who it was. Now you know how some people they this is what they do. They'll sit there and be like. I don't know who did it, but last night, you know, they tell all this stuff. <laughs> he did come by drunk, asking me to hang out by 6 <laughs> mm -mm. I didn't tell him to do that, man. Well, I remember you talking about drinking. I remember one time I was hanging with my boy Buddy. Oh, and um, who out? Who was younger? We hanging. And I, I remember, you know, I was driving initially, and um, he um, he ended up driving while I was drinking. Mm -hmm. I remember the next day, I woke up at a, in a place I'd never seen before. I said, where am I? <laughs> I was like, I done, I done snuck in somebody's window or something. How did I get in here? How'd you feel? Was it scary? It was scary. I didn't know if I was going to walk out somebody would have a shotgun. <laughs> or somebody going to be like, what you doing in my house? You know, my, you know, I just didn't know what was going to happen. So anyway, it turns out it, we, we were at his sister Pude house. And um, she, uh, you know, they let me stay there that night. But I was in a room that I'd never been in in her house. I knew the rest of the house. Oh, like I a just guest didn't know room? That, yeah, I was mm -hmm. just like, what is, I've never seen this room. But buddy said the night before, he was like, I was in the passenger seat, so he went to check to see if I could stay. He was like, turn the car, turn the car off, man. And he was I was like, turn the heat on, mm -hmm. the air, turn the signal light on, <laughs> close the vents. You're doing everything. Everything but turn the car off. <laughs> I was just sitting there. He turned the car off, man. <laughs> Probably sitting there sweating. It's 90 degrees, that's I got the heat blast. So he said, he, and you know he stood in just laughing. He mm. ain't helping. He stood there as long as I did, as long as I made a fool of myself. If, if, if the social media was popping back then, he would have recorded you at least. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I 
I was down in flames, man. That's a bad feeling. I was down in flames. When you don't know where you wake up at. That's bad. I'm dangerous. It's just dangerous. It is. I thought I was in some 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 woman house. Some man I was in there. <laughs> no, I didn't know where I was. <laughs> I don't know how you what you did. I know you were like this. Oh yeah, but before <laughs> I went out. No, I was talking. Not at first. <laughs> then I heard her husband. And, you know, I heard his wife like that sound like, you know. Good for you, God. You look great. I think they're cooking breakfast and stuff too. I know I smell the food. Mm -hmm. That's funny. What was Buddy in another room? He was already up and dressed. What time was it when you got up? I probably got about 12, 1 o'clock. You know, that's late for that's him. That's late for him, y'all. Late. Thank God. Tell, tell us a story about you having too much to drink. Or oh, it never happened. Hmm. Well, you that one had to cook out there, but. Mm-mm. Send me home. I'm not a, I'm not a heavy hitter. <laughs> Charles be, she like, she'd cry, she get, she, she get drunk, she'd be like, oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> I hiss me in me. I'm not a drinker like that. Now, what I might do is go to sleep and act silly before I fall asleep. Have you ever had a, a crazy moment? Too much alcohol that you can recall. You don't do it often, so you got to remember. Sleep, maybe. I or or crazy. Joke, joke around, but nothing like crazy that I can remember. Well, okay. I think I joke around a lot. Like, I might act silly. But um, but as far as like um, like a story, I don't have one. Y'all got any any mm. any stories out there? Any any any? I had too much to drink stories or oh my God. or any cookout stories. Y'all got any cookout stories where somebody just overdid it? I'm sure we all do. Mm -hmm. I'm sure. I'm telling you, Lord. We got a story, but we're not going to say the person's name, but this person, like them stories when somebody want to hang with the big dogs. Oh, my <laughs> God. Yeah, we we can't talk no about name. it now, but we had somebody that went overboard, and it won't We was playing the alphabet game. Alphabet game, mm-hmm. And, I, oh, I, this, is what, this is what I do. I, this is what I, I, I get down. I get down. Everybody like, look. Oh. And we were like, look, man, we don't we don't rock like that. We, we I don't we, get down. We ain't no lightweights now. Don't come up in here and sleep. Slip. He, he came up in there slipping. He would sleep on us, thinking we won't we, we we couldn't handle it. But the, what's so funny is the some the people that were there, they knew that they couldn't. Like there's a like that's like Oh yeah, they there, were like there were like a few people that was like, okay, I'm okay, not going I'm not so a drinker. far. I but am, this yeah. person was like, okay, yeah. They had their eyes set on, on, on two of us like Oh, so they going hard. Yeah. I can, I can, I can get them. Joker ended up outside three good. degrees on laying on the ground, mm -hmm. throwing up some everything. <laughs> yeah, that that story. We got to tell the whole story one day. Yeah. We got time. We ain't got time now. Mm -mm. We'll have y'all laughing. Mm -mm. But yeah. What's your last name, man? It don't even it matter. It don't even matter. <laughs> we knew then. I like, saw yeah. yeah, he. he, he. <laughs> You gotta get this guy to bed. Get this guy some water. <laughs> oh my gosh! It was sorry, the sorry to made the cookout story about the drunks. <laughs> all the, all the before I let go. Look, yeah, uh, I love there's so it. many things we could have talked about, and, and no, I it's just like it just came to me. You know, I was just sitting here talking, and I was just talking because I recall, I remember family events we would have. And normally people would drink at a cookout, but you would always have one or two people that like was rowdy, like just rowdy. And then you have the other group, some people just having fun. They're playing cards, they're the, having the, fun. What about the, da the dancing uncle? <laughs> God. I have an uncle that dance. Then, he sung then, country music then, every time. What was the song he's always saying? Um, Mama, don't let your babies grow up to be cowboys. <laughs> Every time, yeah. And then, and then you got the one aunt that's got to drop it like it's hot. Yeah. But she, stop it. 
You stop that. It's, it's, it's just like pretty much it's, it's just one thing that's interesting about it for me is you see so many different personalities and so many people comfortable in their skin. Well, what would we be at this point, though? Because back when we used to go to cookouts a lot, we were on the other end. We were the kids. Yeah. Like I wouldn't now, know what they'd be saying about us. I'd be playing cards and chilling. That's what I think I'd be doing. Yeah. That's what I think I'd be doing, but you know, but you know, yeah, I wouldn't even try to talk about that right now. But it just came to me. I thought about it. That's all good, man. That red. I think it's because I was talking about the red, red cups, cup. probably. Yeah, the red cup. Red cups. Yeah. Paper place, but yeah, but yeah, y'all. We want to stop through, you know, this this collab. Um, one big happy family. Um, you know what I'm saying? It's 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 a joint. That that that's a, that's growing and expanding, you know. Uh, our brethren, Big Belly Bob, you know what I'm saying, spearheaded it, spearheaded it and whatnot, and we're just excited to be a part of this. So we hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And there's a lot more premieres yeah. after, us, after us, so go over to the next uh, person. And um, I wish I had my list in front but, of me now. But we're not going to name names this time because last time we did it, the schedule changed and we right. told people to go to the wrong well, I, place. I, I don't know who it is. Anyway, so we're not, so. yeah. So, but just make sure you, if you Google, um, Google, not Google, if you go on YouTube, just search, and then just search um, OBHF Summer Kickoff Cookout Collab. No, well, well, no, I tell you what, you, I tell you what to do. How do you do? If you're watching this premiere, just look at what everybody's put putting in the chat right now. Oh yeah, now. that's true. It'll they tell, be in the they chat. telling you where to go we'll right now. We telling go. you where to go right that's now. That's exactly actually. right. So you know, we appreciate y'all hanging out. You dig? Look, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, like, share this video. What you want your big big baby Bob another shout out? Share, share, share it out, share it out, share it out, share it out, share share it out. out. Share yeah. It out. yeah. Yeah, so y'all make right. sure you, uh, you subscribe, like, share, and comment. Click that post notification bell. You guys will be notified every single time we drop a video. All right? Love conquers all. Together we stand. Divided we fall. Team Jackson, peace, peace and love. Starting to really believe that communication is the key. I think communication is the key. We need to start communicating more. Let's just start communicating more. Let's have more conversations.